Dwight, I have exciting news for you. What? I think you're going to like it. You can't tantalize me. If you got a promotion, you will be assembling a team to go to Tallahassee for three weeks to develop and launch a chain of Sabre stores. Yes! Yes! Yeah, 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 yeah! My first task is special project manager Dwight Schrute, assembling a crack team. I need people who are loyal, people who will help me get an inroad with the gay Hispanic community, people who won't be missed. What? We don't need idiots. Does it hurt me? Good for nothings, meth heads, or what's your name? Kathy. Kathy. Here's your team. Daryl and Phyllis, you can have. But you're also taking Kathy, Kelly, and Kevin. Oh, God. You have two young, dynamic people in this office who know trends, who know youth. That's myself and Kelly Kapoor. You need one of us there. Or both? Not both. Just one. Me. Or if not me, Kelly. Ideally me. Again, youth knowledge. That's what you get when you put Ryan Howard on your special project team. Or Kelly Kapoor. Again, not both. Because I feel like that I'm in a place with my gambling rehab that I can finally start going to dog racing again. You know, just sitting, watching, enjoying the sport, maybe putting down a few dollars if there's like a crazy mismatch or something. Okay. Thank you, Kevin. We'll let you know. Thank you. When do we leave? Thank you. Florida Stanley smiles. Florida Stanley is happy to go to work. Florida Stanley is who you want on your Florida team. <laughs> well, no, no, absolutely not. You are not going over my dead body. No, Tunes, Amy. Tunes, I'm really sorry. You're too essential to the operation here. I can't oh, let you go. I wouldn't say that. That's, that's a bit much. You know, Dwight, he didn't want me to go, the smart move, but he'd tell Andy that I actually am essential to the operation. That way I couldn't go. Jim is essential Hold on, to just want to get it on camera. Andy, Jim is just too... Is, Essential. This is stupid! Cut! All right, I'm gonna pack my trunks. He doesn't even wanna go. Well, I got a text from RC inviting me to come down, so I think that's gonna make us roommates. Oh my God. Okay, listen up everyone, here's who's going to Florida. Kathy. What? Stanley. No. Ryan. No! Aaron. And Jim. You gotta be kidding me, okay. Pop it. Cool for your kids. Yeah, it's weird being away from them. Never done this before. Attention, Dunder Mifflin Group. Proceed outside. The vehicle is waiting. Seats have been assigned. Shotgun goes to Ryan. Congratulations, Ryan. Huh, don't see too many museums around here. OK, Twiggy, that's enough. Get in the car. Hey, are you OK? I'm fine, OK? I just stress, you know, because I care about this project. And frankly, the fact that none of you are vomiting or diarrheal right now, I find very alarming. Who says none of us are diarrheal? Stanley, did you just come back from burning down a rival nightclub? Laugh it up, Alfred. I'm in Florida for a month without my family. I'm gonna enjoy this. Wanna get in? You can work the iPod. Yes. Ah, you're a nice guy, Jim, but you have no idea how to vacation. Find some Kenny Loggins. Loggins and Messina. Did I say Messina? How's the drive? Fantastic. Stanley drives so fast. Life is short. Drive fast and leave a sexy corpse. That's one of my mottos. Quick query, Halpert. No way. Packer. You can't put me down. Too strong. Yeah, Dwight and Jim tried to get me fired. But I landed on my feet down here in Florida. You see, this cat's got nine lives. And a nine-inch... Wow. Are you that bored? Yeah, it's just rum. I'm not bored. I'm a pirate. Is that another motto? It's whatever you want. Mm. Or do you only drink with your kids? Uh, let's do it. Whoa, that's healthy. I've spent so much of my life telling myself, please don't end up like Stanley. <laughs> and now I'm wondering if I even have what it takes. We have the Sabre Pyramid, right? Hmm? We've got a bunch of humans. You guys. Humans, pyramid. Human pyramid. Do you follow? It's a team building exercise. You love it. Who's in? Hmm? Yep. Tallahassee, let's go. Jim, are you in? Oh, I don't know. Sounds like a hoot. I'm in. All right. What the heck? Let's do it. I'll be on top. It's the most important position. Dude, I think you have appendicitis. Uh, oh, oh. Arrest Jim. He poisoned me. What? No. 
No, it was not a poisoning. You need an operation. You have appendicitis. Oh, who called it? Nothing but net. Don't remember me like this. Remember me as the man who pulled down the screen. Ah. Ah. I can do it. Ah. It's a tech support area. Bring your product. Bunch of nerdy virgins fix it on the spot. Huge for building loyalty. Yes, that is a very good point. Yeah, Todd. Decent idea. Obvious. But interesting. Dwight, are you all right? I'm great. How are you? The only thing you need to know about retail consumer habits is that consumers are mindless lemmings. They just want to be told what to do. Shopping habits are both seasonal and cyclical. What does this mean? I can feel this one. No, uh, sit down. Seasonal. Well, the Christmas shopping season is certainly a busy one. Uh, back to school is as well, and in early summer it seems to slow down a bit. But shopping is also cyclical. The menstrual cycle determines every choice a woman makes. You see, during ovulation, a woman's only goal is to get pregnant. Jim, could you fetch me some ice chips? Thank you. Oh, God. Anderson's three pillars of retail. Crucial. So important. Next. Are there any questions? What are the three pillars of retail? Convenience. Ingredients. Service. Burgers. Building loyalty. Killing royalty. But you know what is important? Is Dwight's pillars. And there is only one. Desire. Do we have a desire? to dominate the retail space. Not just succeed in it, but to dominate. And looking around this room, I'm not so sure that we do. Thank you very much. Any other questions? Jim. You are bleeding through your shirt. Oops. Today is the test launch day for the inaugural Sabre store. <laughs> and I, Dwight Schrute, am in charge of the entire operation. And if I can prove myself today, and the store is a hit with the media, and Nelly sees this, the vice presidency is mine. Hey, are you holding this chair? Because I feel like I'm yes. going to fall off. Yes. I'm Just, not wearing the right yeah, shoes for okay. this. We went over this, OK? Uh, yeah, I already bought my pyramid, but I don't want to leave yet. I haven't had so much fun since seeing Zooey Desh channel at the Cacciarella Music Festival. It's so fun. Saber, it's time to come home. Yeah. I mean, I think it seems like you're a little nervous. Yeah, no Sherlock, can somebody please tell me something encouraging about this presentation okay. before I go out there and find a million people and do I it? I know, I know, champ. Just calm down because, listen, when you're out in mm -hmm. front of all of those people, yeah, what? you just need to realize yeah. so much rides on this. You have no idea. Dwight. I'm trying to make it feel important. God, I wish Kelly were here. She always knew what to say. Um, oh, Ryan. <laughs> You're so smart. You're smarter than Mark Zuckerberg and those Google guys all combined. <laughs> you're so ignorant, you barely know what you're talking about. It's so ridiculous. <laughs> you really need to read a couple books. <laughs> What's a book? <laughs> oh my god, you're so embarrassing. <laughs> my mom would say the best stuff, though. <clears throat> you can... You can do it, Ryan. And you know that I'm capable of this. You're the only one who can do it, sweetie. What did you think of the presentation? I thought it was great, sweetie. I would just fix that one part Oh, fix it. means you hate it. I knew it. Hey, Uncle Lucas, it's your nephew, Ryan. Um, honestly, I could use a prescription for Ridlin right now. Well, I know you did one for Aunt Carol. How are you doing? Don't talk to me right now. I'm sorry. I, I know you're my boss, but seriously, you need to get the hell out of my face. What I don't your little man is unraveling. How long has he been in the bathroom? What, 10 minutes? Jeez, what's he doing in there? Uh, oh, that's my phone. Am I allowed to answer it, or are you gonna freak out? Are there bloggers around? It's Ryan. I'm sorry, I lied, I'm not in the bathroom, I can't do it, I need to see my mom, I'm going home. What is the delay here? Where is Ryan? Why is he not here? I had to send him home. As brilliant and creative as he is, he is nothing compared to this guy. Uh... Time, space, gender. There are no rules anymore. All boundaries are breaking down 
in the wake of the infinite future. The only thing that the only thing that remain the only thing that remains are the things that have stood the test of time: love, values, and of course, the pyramids. The strongest shape ever constructed, a shape that fits all other shapes inside of it. No, that's it's true. This is the future because this is the past. I've been through a lot of issues in my life. I've seen drug addiction, unemployment. I've been in a relationship that tore my heart apart without ever being able to accept that love drove the pain. When I was 10 years old, my parents took me to Disney World. I cried the whole time. With the pyramid, you have the connection to everything in time and space. Oh. Ah. Saber, it's time to come home. Okay, I will be the first to admit it, we could have integrated more Chuck into the presentation. Right. you're the vice president. <laughs> yeah! Okay! <laughs> <laughs>